In this video, I would like to introduce you to Time Machine. Time Machine is a backup program on your Mac, which is really pretty handy. And it's just about set it and forget it. So um, when you have a computer, you should have a backup of your data because your data is the most important and most valuable stuff you have on your computer. You can replace programs and the, and the operating system, but you cannot get your data back when, once it's lost. So make sure you make a uh, backup from your data wherever you are. To do so, you can on your Mac just get an um, external hard disk, put it behind your Mac, just put it into an USB port and you are done. It asks you, should I use that as a backup volume? You say yes and you can set it and forget it until something happens. When you have a MacBook, it might be a good idea to have the time capsule from Mac. It's a bit more expensive, but it has a big advantage that you have it in your wireless LAN network included. And then when you get back into your wireless LAN network, the backup automatically starts. You, so you won't have to remember to just uh, pull in the hard disk. Yeah, that's the most important thing. We can now check time machine. So let me get here to my time machine. Where you go? Here you go. And um, let's go to open time machine preferences because there you can choose some settings. You can also access it over your system preferences, of course. And what you can do here is you can select the disk. Make sure that your disk the hard disk you have uh, an external hard disk always a bit bigger than your internal disk is because then you drag it into your computer and the computer is baked up completely and then when something changes the oldest backup is replaced with a newer one and so forth so you can always go back in time and have a full backup and then all the changes available so you click here, select disk, and then just choose a disk you want to use as a backup. And then that's it. And then you can also exclude some folders. For example, if you don't want to back up my external hard drives, I just uh, click a minus and these are excluded. Or I click a plus and include some folders. Okay, so let's get into the time machine so you can see that as well. I closed the preferences. So let's enter time machine and check out the desktop. So now you see we are in time machine because all these windows are from several dates in the past. And I can now go back into time and see when something was on my desktop and can easily get that back. I just mark it and say restore and it will be back on my computer. Before I do so, go here and you see how many backups I have because the computer does big day, does hourly backups in this case and easily gets files back. So for example, if I want this file back, I just mark it and then click restore and it goes for and here you go, here's my file, it's back now. Yeah, you see how great that works. And um, you can do that once and never again. So make sure you bake up your data because your data is valuable and you really shouldn't play with it. Imagine all your pictures are gone, all the family photos, and it will be a complete disaster. So make sure you do backups properly.